hello viewers i welcome you all from hlt of tech channel today uh, we will see how we can pass uh, multiple parameters uh, in uh, using multiple functions in one javascript web resource or file okay for that purpose what we will use we will use the uh, event of get form context and in which we will define two functions the fun first function name will be on load the second function name will be on save and what we will do uh, in uh, first function of on load we will define a on load event and uh, in second function we will define on save event for example when we will open a form uh, the on load event will be called in which uh, in which the all the things that are defined in function uh, of on load will be executed whereas uh, when the form will be saved uh, the event of on save will be called in which all the uh, activities or events that are defined in uh, the function of on save will be triggered so let's start uh, in my hrm environment this is one entity uh, that is this one now what i want to do i want that whenever a new form will be opened uh, our own load event will be called and as soon as the form will be saved the uh, own save event will be called so let's start i will go in settings solutions banking i will go into that particular uh, solution in which my uh, branch entity is created i will go into forms and main form now in main form i will go into form properties in form properties i have added a one function if i double click it let me show you here about this function this function uh, contains two functions okay uh, sorry this web resource content or this javascript web resource comprises of two functions if we uh, talk about the first function what is it let me show you here it is in, in this function uh, the function name is on load and the uh, uh, parameter pass is execution context what uh, first of all I will define one variable that is form context which is used to uh, get the value which is uh, obtained from execution context dot get form context okay get form context is a function uh, is a method uh, which is uh, obtained uh, through uh, execution context in version 9.0 uh, before uh, version 9.0 in previous versions it was xrm dot page now it has been changed to execution context dot get form context now uh, after getting the value what I will do I will uh, define one alert di dialog that is this is an alert for on load event okay as soon as uh, the form will be uh, loaded the message will appear and uh, then I will define one function in which alert dialog will comprise of e dot message okay now one more function is that on save execution context this is sa same uh, except that it will be called on on save event okay so uh, now if I click on okay now first of all the activity will be uh, first activity will be on on load the file is same that is JavaScript web resource file is same the function that I will use will be on load okay and I will also pass execution context as first parameter because execution context is pass here okay so after that I will click on okay now one more thing is that uh, I have o one more uh, function in the same JScript web resource content that is on save. Okay, this is another function that will be passed to the other event that is on load on save. In on save event, 
what I will do I will say that the function that will be executed will be on save okay and execution will be uh, passed as first parameter I will click on okay and then I will click on uh, let me min uh, reset it to 100% I will click on save and publish as soon as it is published now I will go and refresh the page I'm going to branches and as soon as I click on uh, first uh, on load event will be triggered and it will show me on load is not defined at eval okay uh, let me see what I have done mistake setting solution banking entities branch forms form properties on load function the function name is on load okay uh, the problem is that I did not give the correct spelling the ca it is case sensitive okay uh, same is for on save as well if I go and copy it it's always recommended practice that you copy it rather than typing it okay so I will click on this okay so I will save it publish it after that I will go into again branches refresh the page now if I uh, open the first uh, record as soon as the form is opened it will show you a alert message okay this is an alert for own load event it means that uh, this alert is uh, triggered uh, because it was defined in the event of own load okay now if I change any value and save it now the alert of own save event will be triggered okay so uh, I will click OK in this way you can uh, define multiple functions in one JavaScript web resource file and pass multiple parameters uh, th through multiple functions okay I thank you all for watching this video and guys subscribe my channel and enjoy watching more videos